Welcome back to Cape Cod Like a Local. Today I'd like to talk about the feel of Cape Cod. What I mean by that is I feel differently if I'm traveling on 6A or Route 6 and I wanted to share that information with you. We're going to start over the Sagamore Bridge that was built in 1932. We're going to travel from Bourne to Provincetown on Route 6A. Route 6A has the most unique feeling. You're taken back in time. The homes are built from the 17th century to the 20th century. The trees line the street and they form an arbor over the, the streetway as well. It's, it's just an amazing place to be. You find a few bed and breakfasts or maybe some inns, a few restaurants, but it's not bustling like the other towns are. The next route we're going to travel on is Route 6. This runs parallel with 6A. This is called the Mid Cape Highway, and this has exits all the way down to Orleans, and then the road narrows down to two lanes. The Mid Cape provides great opportunity to go to different restaurants off of each exit, grocery shopping, to the beaches. Each direction off the exits offers so many things. The next route we're going to try is we're going to go over the Bourne Bridge, which was built in 1933, and we're going to travel on Route 28. So this starts in Bourne, and you travel up to Falmouth, and then it goes across the Cape over to Hyannis and continues down to Orleans. Route 28 has definitely a different feel. This is much more bustling commercial. You'll stay at hotels and motels, many, many restaurants along the way, um, a variety of uh, places to shop as well. Much busier road. This road also has a lot of tourist attractions. Maybe it's mini golf. Maybe it's an ice cream place. It's all great on Cape Cod. I invite you to come to Cape Cod and see what you feel on these roads. See you next week. Bye.